What's up, YouTube? Chris Six here. I'm coming at you with the SmackDown results from tonight's show on USA Network. And it opened up with Seth Rollins giving an open challenge to anybody in the back uh, stage area for the main event tonight. Sami Zayn's the one that took him up on that, but not after going through a D uh, Dean Ambrose Ambrose Asylum episode tonight with starring Sami Zayn and Seth Rollins. Alberto Del Rio and Cesaro are still fuming after the Money in the Bank match uh, last Sunday, and today we got to see another match against these two guys. Wonderful match, but Cesaro ends up taking the win against Alberto Del Rio. The second match that we uh, got to have was another match against Apollo Crews and Sheamus, and Sheamus ends up beating Apollo Crews this match. That's a shame. I really, I really wanted Apollo Crews to win. I'm not really a big Sheamus fan. Not buying into the whole thing of uh, his uh, Miz, Mr. Hollywood uh, bullshit that he's running uh, now on on Raw and SmackDown. That that gimmick's already been done. I'm kind of tired of it. Uh, let's see something new, WWE. Come on. Then we also had another slight rematch for tonight from the Money in the Bank show. Uh, it was between two of the tag teams. It was in the tag team uh, match during Money in the Bank. It was the New Day versus the Vaude Villains. And the New Day come out on top again against the Vaude Villains. I mean, hey, New Day does rock. But uh, again, I'm getting tired of those guys' gimmick also. Let's see something fresh. Come on. Please, come on, WWE. Let's see something fresh for the Tag Team Championship. I know you like to try to run uh, its course and beat people's records and, and all that, but shit, you're, you're boring us to death. We got to see another match uh, with Becky Lynch tonight. Uh, it was a pretty decent match against Dana Brooke. Just not really such a big fan of Charlotte having to be there at the ringside all the time. I mean, she's doing the same dirty stuff that her dad did. But uh, Dana Brooke ends up beating Becky Lynch during this match. It wasn't for anything big. Uh, but uh, right after the match was over, we had seen Charlotte and Sasha, or seen Charlotte and um, Dana Brooke trying to gang up on Becky Lynch. And Sasha Banks comes out. And uh, clears the ring. She delivers the bank statement to to Dana Brooks. And I mean, come on, we we got it. We've got to have a Sasha Banks and Charlotte matchup soon. We've got to have a match for the women's championship. I would love to see one uh, coming soon, uh, either next week. I mean, we haven't seen Sasha Banks really really wrestle in a while now. Please, WWE, give us a match at least by Battleground with Sasha Banks and Charlotte. And then for our main event, we had that Seth Rollins and Sami Zayn match. I, I was pulling for Sami Zayn. I knew Seth Rollins was going to pull it off. He ended up getting the win. Uh, I mean, it, it would be insane for WWE to not give Seth Rollins a, a good couple wins, being that he's been injured for the last seven months. It's it's nice to see that, but I'd also like to see uh, Sami Zayn being pushed a little bit more because uh, he has a lot more talent than what WWE is giving him. I mean, that is exactly my opinion about uh, AJ Styles, too. I, I think WWE is holding him back. They're not giving him enough credit where credit's due. I mean, the, some of these guys have had five-star matches. Uh, come on. Come on, WWE. Give these guys more credit. Let them do a little bit more. Give them a little more free reign with what they want to do as, with their character. I mean, stop holding them back. But uh, that's all I've got for you guys. That's just my opinion. Uh, like, subscribe. It's all down below. Uh, follow me on, um, on my Facebook. It, it's at uh, Chris Wilson. Uh, but, uh, yeah, hit me up on the subscribe uh, down there. Leave some comments. Whatever you got to do, I'm out.